What is going on guys? gishi 123 here with more Grand Theft Auto 5 and today guys we have another great mod coming to you. Today, 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 we are going to be lifting a golf cart. You heard me right, we are actually going to be installing a lift kit on this golf cart. We're going to be souping up the engine as well so this thing can go super fast. We're going to be giving it a little bit more torque, a little bit more engine power, and all that good stuff. So, uh, I think you guys are going to enjoy this. This one should be fun. But before we uh, lift anything, I want to do just a simple test here with the base version of the golf cart. So we're just going to kind of take it for a spin here before lifting it, before, you know, jacking up the engine. Uh, just kind of get a feel for how it handles. But while we do this, guys, if you do happen to enjoy this stream, please drop a like down below. And if you are new to the channel, you've never been here before, uh, feel free to subscribe down below. If you happen to do either of those, let me know here in the chat. I'm going to be shouting out those of you who like and subscribe all stream long. So let me know. Let me know. Uh, so, ooh, so far it's actually not horrible. I mean, obviously engine speed, this thing's really weak. I think it runs off of electric. I mean, I don't hear an engine, so I'd say electric is pretty a pretty safe bet. Uh, besides that, though, you'll notice that you can hear lots of scraping, like... Oh, even, even that. We're bottoming out on this rock that isn't even that big. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? If we had the lift kit installed, we would just be driving right over top of this thing. Oh my goodness, we are actually completely stuck. Luckily, I have a button command here that can just move us right on forward. But, uh, had we been lifted there, I don't think that would have happened. And, uh, oh, I almost forgot before we get too far into this, let me make it so I can see what you guys are saying to me here in the live stream chat. Let's get it going, let's get it going. What's going on, everybody? Welcome to the stream. We've got Jack, Cannon, Emperor, Cohen, Will Fox, Boy Got the Little Cut. Or the lit cut, rather. Uh, Colton, LB all day, Jay Shoop, Nathan, Andrew. Guys, what is up? Thank you, thank you for tuning in. Welcome to the stream! Oh my gosh, I'm so glad we didn't flood that just now. I'm really glad that we did not just flood the engine already. Alright, so we're just gonna loop around this back end here, and then we are gonna start lifting this bad boy up. We're gonna give it, like I said, a little bit of engine power. We're gonna give it a slight lift, but then the other thing that we're gonna do is throughout the stream, we're gonna continue to lift it higher and higher. So we're gonna start off with a lift that's not super insane, but by the end of it, in 40 minutes or so, uh, you can actually make these lifts as high as like three feet high, like super high. We can get this golf cart so high off the ground, so I think it's going to be pretty sweet. Uh, let's get back over to our starting position. Now that we've kind of driven it around, this thing looks so ridiculous. Look at that. Look at that. How? Oh, oh no. Get through it. Get through it. We are definitely flooding this. Let me see if I can use some... Oh, I think it's too late. It is much too late. Had I been prepared, I could have saved it. Uh, so let's go ahead and quickly, quickly, quickly spawn in a new one of these... <laughs> It will not take long, so let's delete this one. Let's go back here. Let's open up vehicle spawning. I believe this is called the caddy? Yes, yes. All right, and last thing we want to do is, uh, the green one looks okay, but it doesn't look great with my clothing. You know, I think it could look a little better. So let's just do color menu and put it back to orange. And there you have it, boys. We are back in it. We are back in it, ready to go. <laughs> Alright, yeah, James, I agree, dude. Alright, so, guys, why don't we just hop right to it? Why don't we get it going? Let's get a lift kit installed on this thing. So, what we're gonna do here is open up our stancing menu, V stancer, go to the suspension menu, and uh, you can change a lot of things with this one. But today, we're mainly gonna be doing the height and the width. So, let's do the front height first. You can see that we're at a default of negative 50, the value up there, anyway. And uh, let's, let's start bumping that up. Watch this front end here. You are gonna see this front end slowly rise here. Uh, let's start it off at a value of like 75. This is, you know, a pretty, uh, you know, basic starter lift here. We're not doing anything crazy right off the bat. Now you will notice my wheels start to glitch a little bit. The glitching will go away. As you start to drive around with this thing, the glitching does stop. So before we set off, one other thing that we should do, why don't we make these wheels a little wider, the wheelbase. So front track width, you can see here, boom, 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 boom. We uh, we can make that wheelbase a little bit wider, and that's going to help to stabilize us. It's going to make it so that we don't turn over quite as easily on the sharp turns. So, this glitching should stop any second. Nice. Oh, still going a little bit. Okay. The glitching should come to a complete stop, though. This mod is weird. It Once you start driving around, it's like... 
it adjusts to the lift. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. But already, this thing is doing much better. I already hear way less scraping. You can see that uh, going over these little bumps and stuff, much better. Oh, oh, get out of there, get out of there! But why don't we go ahead and give this thing a little bit of engine power as well. We've got the base lift installed. I think, you know what? You know what? Let's lift a little bit higher. This is, this is cool, but I want to see it a little higher. Let's take it up to 80. Just give it a few, a couple more inches. Rear height, 80 as well. Uh, already looking good. But like I said, as the stream goes, we are going to lift this thing higher and higher until it's just utterly ridiculous. Uh, so now let's soup up the engine a little bit. We're going to soup up the engine. How do we get to that? I believe we go to... Uh, what is it? Vehicle options, page two. There it is. Okay, power multiplier, torque multiplier. So we're going to give this thing about double the power. Because as you guys know, the golf cart tends to be extremely weak, extremely slow. So now we've upped these values as well. Let's see how it handles. Let's see how it handles. Oh, oh, you can see that it's already a little bit more unstable. Obviously due to that higher center of gravity coming from the lift. But uh, speed-wise and lift-wise, already looking a little better. But uh, we're not going to stop here, guys. We are not... Not, not, not gonna stop here. Uh, what happens if we try going up, like, the side of a hill? <sighs> Unfortunately, we still have major traction issues and still not enough, uh, power in the engine. Uh, yo, guys, thank you for dropping those subs and likes. Uh, Gage Ingram, thanks for something, dude. Welcome to the family. Uh, Tim, thank you for dropping that like. Cody, thank you for dropping the like as well. Devin, thanks for the like and the sub, my dude. Oh, 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 get out of that water. Get out of the water. All right, guys. <laughs> Let's teleport to a new spot on the map. We're going to go over here to the swamp, and uh, this is where we're going to lift it up a little bit higher. Player, teleport, marker, there we go. There we go, there we go. So, so far this thing's looking okay. Uh, before we set off uh, on it, though, I do want to give it a little bit more engine power. You know, we, we gave it some power already. We did. It, we definitely gave it some, but it didn't seem to make a huge difference here. So let's try this. Uh, let's give it a little bit more. Uh, torque multiplier. Let's send it up even higher. Engine multiplier. <laughs> take it even higher, boys. Ooh, you can't take that one too high. We'll save that one then at 100. Hopefully, we can notice some uh, some difference here. Yo, Burrow, Stunt Bros, Cannon, uh, Peyton, Caleb, Linea. Guys, thank you so much for dropping those likes down below. It's super appreciated. All right, so this is where that engine power is coming in handy here. You can see that, ooh, we are highly unstable due to the lift. Uh, what we're probably going to want to do here is make this wheelbase a little bit wider. A uh, wider wheelbase, like I said, will give us better stabilization, make us a little less prone to flipping over as well. Uh, we could take it to the military base, yeah. We're not going to do that immediately, but uh, we could definitely make a stop there. So this thing actually looks pretty legit driving through the swamp here. Oh! Get out of that water! Get out of that water! A little bit of water is okay, but like I said, as you guys know, we just do not want to hydro-lock the engine. We do not want to do that. Uh, yo, Larry, the, uh, Larry Turner. What is up, dude? Larry Turner, the second, or the third, I can't remember. Regardless, welcome back, my dude. Welcome back, welcome back. Alright, guys, what do you say? Should we, uh, should we make this thing a little taller already? Should we add a little bit of a lift? Like I said, all stream long. Ooh! We're gonna be lifting this thing higher and higher. Uh, let's do it. And let's also make that wheelbase a little bit wider. Let me go up here on this hill, out of the uh, out of the weeds and stuff, so we can see what we're working with here. Uh, oh, these weeds are so tall. I mean, I guess that's okay. No, I want to be able to see the lift. These these weeds are like blocking what's happening. Okay, we'll do it right here. We'll do it right here. So let's bring this thing up a little higher and make the wheels a little uh, farther apart there to steady us out a little bit. So front height. I don't know how much higher we can go here before it starts like really glitching bad. Let's try 90. Oh my goodness. Okay, so front we've got 90. Rear height, let's do 90 as well. Okay, no glitching. No glitching. This is good. And now wheelbase, we definitely want to set these things farther apart here. So um, front track width. Boom, 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 boom. That looks a lot better. Look at the front there compared to the back. You can see them getting a little further apart. Uh, value of 70. Let's make the back match the front. So back widen it up. Okay. So, oh my gosh, this thing is starting to look legit. Whew. 
I think that our uh, our higher lift, the instability should hopefully be offset by compensating with that uh, the farther wheelbase. So we'll see. We'll find out. I don't know. Let's see how this thing handles. Let's see how it turns. Uh, once again, thank you guys for dropping those likes on the stream. I appreciate the support, guys. Appreciate it a lot. All right. So, oh, we got some fishermen up here. Oh, 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 no, no. Nice! The lift saved us! I thought, once again, I was like, okay, we're flooding this for sure. But thankfully, we've got this thing lifted up, what, a good two feet or so? We have near a two foot lift, maybe a foot and a half. Looks like close to ten inches. And so, uh, driving through this water here. Much easier than it would usually be. Oh, jeez! No! <laughs> that dude just flipped me over. Oh, he has a gun! He has a gun! Oh my gosh, they both have guns! Do not tell me I'm going to literally die right now during this stream. Get away from him. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm going to I'm going to pull out my gun as well here. Hold on, hold on. Apparently, I think he's running over for me. Okay. Uh get all weapons, get all weapons. All right. I got to make sure I take this guy out. I cannot have him kill me out here. Where's he at? Where's he at? Where's he at? I see him on the mini map. He should be like right in front of me. And we're going to get back to the off-roading. I hear him yelling! I hear him doing his yippee ki -yay. Oh! I can't see him through the weeds, but he can see me! Alright, we're just getting the full auto weapon out. Full auto. We're going to rush him. There we go. You don't know what these people are like out here. Out here in the countryside, these fishermen, they're crazy. They are absolutely crazy. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm glad we didn't die there. We stayed alive. Yo, Aaron Balcom, you said you are new to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Glad you decided to swing by. Welcome to the stream. Try to hook up a trailer, Gene. I wish that would work. I wish it would work, but unfortunately, the golf cart is not, uh, coded to haul a trailer. For obvious reasons. For obvious reasons. So, uh, let's take a look here at our golf cart. Let's, let's see, uh, ooh! We gotta make it farther upstream here. We've been lollygagging a little bit, taking our time. Ooh. Get through that. Ooh, get out, get out, get out. Nice. I like the blood splatter on the front. It's definitely a nice touch. Uh, first person doesn't look too bad in the golf cart, but as usual, I don't think the first person tends to do it justice. You really gotta appreciate it from third person to see the lift, to watch it uh, just driving over the terrain. Eric Redemarker, my dude, thank you for clicking onto the stream. Thanks for giving it a chance, checking it out. I appreciate it, dude. Uh, just a quick reminder, if you guys are new here watching today for the first time ever, if you've never been here before, subscribe down below if you are enjoying the stream. Let me know in the chat if you do subscribe. I'd love to give you a personal welcome to the family. So let me know, let me know. Ugh, it slides around a little bit, as you guys can see here. Uh, it, it does tend to slide a little bit. Uh, yo, Corey, what's up, my dude? Welcome back to another stream. Uh, my day's going great, guys. Ooh. Ooh! Okay, there we go, there we go. Alright. Oh, jeez! Watch out! Watch out. Alright, so we are gonna be lifting this thing even a little bit higher here in a second. We're currently on our way over to Mount Chiliad. Oh! Get out! No! Ah, and that's the risk we take. That right there is the risk we take. My goodness. We just flooded our second golf cart. Get out, Franklin! I love how he immediately pulls out his knife. You know, you never know when you might need to shank somebody in the water. Uh, John Fox, thanks for subbing. Justin, thanks for subbing. Lisa, thanks for dropping that like. Uh, Corbin, thanks for subbing. Braver, thanks for subbing. Dakota, Landon Morse. Guys, thank you all for subscribing. Welcome to the family. If I missed any of you guys, though, who did subscribe, feel free to let me know a second time. Occasionally, some of you guys do slip through the radar, but I do what I can. Uh, okay, so let's get another one spawned in here. Here's our caddy. This time it's blue. We've got the blue one. So, let's go ahead and put the lift back on it that we already had. Uh, yo, Mason Vlogs, I appreciate the kind words, my dude. Glad you're enjoying. Thanks for being here. Uh, oh, alright, let's pull off the side of the road. Oh, whoa! Check these dudes out. We've got, like, these mariachi dudes next to their, uh, their lowrider. What we're gonna do next to them is, uh, park next to their low rider, and we're gonna make ourselves a high rider. So, let's go to the suspension menu, and put these, uh, the front end back up where it was. Oops, not the width. Front height. Yo, back up, dude. What's this guy doing? I don't like him walking behind me like that. I don't like him walking behind me like that. Now, see, if we wanted to, what's funny about this mod is that if we wanted to, 
we could make it so that, uh, you know, we only do the front suspension. And obviously, you know, that's a little wacky. I don't know exactly why you would want to do that. But, alternatively, if we wanted to, we could also put the back up really high. And uh, give it kind of like more of an aggressive stance. Let's just mess around with that real quick. So if you want this type of stance, I don't know why you would. This reminds me more of like a drag car or a drag golf cart, if you will. Oh gosh, oh gosh, we actually saved it. Whew. But, uh, this thing kind of, does it drive on its own? I'm not even hitting the gas, and it is just going. What? I literally was not hitting the gas for any of that. It seems like, it seems like when you've got that back end pumped up like that, uh, it tends to just kind of want to drive on its own. Uh, alright, so, let's go ahead and make the, f uh, the front match the back here. Front height. Jack it up. It's time. It is time. We are now sitting at a negative 1.03. What exactly does that mean? Uh, I don't know. What I do know it means is that this thing is super lifted. Let's give it a wider wheelbase than ever to really stabilize us now. We are looking at a wheelbase with a value of 80. And so, look at the stance of this thing. Oh my goodness. One of my favorite parts of this mod, guys. Oh, oh, oh. One of my favorite parts of this mod. If you guys are familiar with Grand Theft Auto modding... Oh! Ooh. Hold on, hold on. I'll finish this thought once I know that I'm not drowning. I'm having trouble climbing up out of this. Ugh. Oh man. Yeah, you can see that the instability of the lift is really starting to hinder us, but we're just gonna have to deal with it. Ugh. I'm gonna put on speed boost here probably, just to uh, help me on some of these inclines if we get stuck. But um, what I was going to say is one of the really cool things about this mod is if you guys are familiar with modding, then you might know that a lot of modding changes the collisions on vehicles. And what do I mean by that? I mean like, essentially, the point of contact on a vehicle. Um, I don't know if I'm explaining this correctly. But essentially, the collisions remain correct despite this mod. Like, when we lift it up, uh, you know, you don't have this invisible barrier below you your vehicle is as lifted as you see it. I don't know if this really makes sense, but, um... Ooh! No! A lot of these mods are purely visual, I guess is what I'm saying. But this one is not purely visual. It really fulfills the purpose of lifting the vehicle, lifting that, uh, that undercarriage up off the ground, and really giving these vehicles a whole new feel. Alright, so still on our way over to Mount Chiliad. This thing is getting completely ridiculous. And for those of you just tuning in, we did soup up the engine as well. We gave this thing a lot more torque, a lot more engine power. Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, yo, Sebastian, thank you for dropping that like below, my dude. Guys, you know what? Why don't we go ahead and, uh, <laughs> Sebastian, you said you love my shirt. Thank you, dude. I've had this shirt for a while. It's just like a classic V-neck, but, uh, you know, V-neck t-shirt, not too bad. Anyways. Why don't we go ahead and get the first like spike of the stream going, guys. Drop those likes down below. Tell me in the chat that you did. I'm going to be shouting out as many of you guys as I can who drop a like. Like goal for this stream, I don't know if we're going to be able to do it, is 1,000 likes. Now, we're very very early into the stream here, so I think it might be possible. We're only about 10, 15 minutes in, so I think we could hit 1,000 by the end. Anyways, let's get it going. Three, two, one, like spike! Uh. Thank you, thank you. Am I going to do a hunting stream? Uh, yeah, I definitely want to. I'm not going to be doing it today, obviously. Uh, today we are just going to be devoting this stream. Just barely fit through there. Just barely fitting on through. The lifted golf cart, ladies and gentlemen. But anyways, ooh! Yeah, another thing that I forgot to show you guys is once you lift this thing high enough, you can actually do a wheelie. Let's see if we can pop a wheelie in this. You ready? I don't know if it's going to work. And... No! No. No. Uh, I think we might need to be on pavement. Pavement's definitely going to give us a little bit more traction for that stuff. Um, Alright, finally almost at the end of the river here. Uh, Mount Chiliad coming up next. Thank you guys so much for dropping those likes and showing your support down below. I appreciate the heck out of it. Uh, Dominic, Sebastian, Christian, Joel, John Fox, Braver. No! Let me get ready to save myself here. Okay, there we go. Yeah, once I go in the water and I know I'm gonna flood... Don't tell me I flooded already. Whew, okay. 
That's that's got to be what I remember to do. Got to remember to just send myself forwards like that so we get out of the water. Because I don't want to have to spawn in another one of these things like every two seconds, you know? Uh, a few more shoutouts going out to Hobo Trash. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, dude. Uh, LaShawn, thank you for the like. The Bad Boy Jr., thanks for the like. Gene Miller, Ernesto, Vedant, uh, Dalton, my dude. Welcome back to the stream, guys. Uh, thanks for dropping those likes down below. Um, let's go ahead and change the color real quick. Back to the orange. The orange looks so much better. Matches my uh, my getup perfectly. Unknown gamer, thanks for the like. Vortex, Mason, Rick, Hernandez, the Beast, the Idiot. <laughs> Your guys' names. I love reading all the names on here. It can be anything from somebody's real name, like John Jones, to just like the most insane thing ever. Uh, so I'm gonna try to cross here, but I do recall having some issues trying to cross here. It looks like you can drive up those rocks, but I'm pretty sure that those rocks are actually really steep. So what I'm going to try to do is... Can we cross down lower? I cheated. I totally cheated. I don't think we were getting through that. There was no chance of us getting through that, so I did uh, kind of send us through there. Okay, so this is where it should get interesting. We've taken this guy through the swamp. We've taken him through the mud a little bit, but what lies ahead... <laughs> I love how easy it is to drive on two wheels on this thing, too. Watch this. You ready? You ready? The sideways wheelie. Oh, damn. I accidentally tipped it super quickly. Anyways, what lies ahead now is that challenge over in the distance. That is Mount Chiliad. And we're going to be attempting to make it to the top. Uh, yo, Crystal Harris, he said you liked and subbed. Welcome to the family. Thanks for subbing. Thanks for dropping that like. Oh. Why is this golf cart so slidey? What the heck? Uh, Aaron Myers, thank you, dude, for dropping that like. Bradley, you as well. Guys, quick comment question for you guys. Let me know here in the stream, where are you guys watching the stream from? Let me know either the country that you are watching from, if it's not the United States. But if you are in the United States, just tell me the state that you're watching from. Uh, just curious. I like knowing where you guys are watching from. Occasionally, we get people viewing from halfway around the world, which is always awesome. People watching from something like Trinidad, or Australia, or... France, lots and lots of uh, lots and lots of different places people tune in from here. Uh, show small cat once again. Small cat, basically pickles and small cat nap all day long. Like all afternoon they sleep, and then four or five in the afternoon they wake up, and then that's when they like start playing and running around and being all cute. Uh, Alex, thanks for the like and the sub, my dude. Welcome to the family. Cameron, thanks for subbing. So, you guys said you are watching the stream from Belgium, oh my gosh, Finland, oh my goodness, Iowa, Washington, Michigan, Louisiana, China, what? Florida, Northport, El Paso, Texas, uh, Copenhagen, what? Denmark, my boy, uh, Missouri, Florida, South Carolina, Sweden, nice, shout out to my Swedish brethren. I believe I have some Swedish in me. I'm not totally sure of my ethnicity, but I think it's like Norwegian, Swedish stuff in there. I think it's somewhere, something in there. Um, you guys said you're also watching from New Zealand. Awesome. Uh, lots of Florida. I feel like I'm seeing a ton of Florida here in the chat. Alright, so I hope we can get up this hill. Let's give it a go. Let's give it a go. Hill climb! Ooh, it's definitely hard to control going up the hill. Definitely hard to control. The steering was almost non-existent. Wow. Okay, we're going to give this a second attempt here. Wow. And I hope we don't have to lower this thing. Maybe we need to give it a wider wheelbase to give us even more stability here. Let's try attempt number two. Okay, that worked out a lot better. Worked out a lot, lot better that time. Thank you guys all for your support right now. I just see tons of people here saying they liked, they subbed in the chat. I, as I always say, I appreciate the heck out of it, guys. Thank you all for being here, clicking on, giving the stream a chance if you're new. And uh, if you're not new, then just coming back for another one. Thank you. Uh, okay, okay. So, what we're going to do here before we go any higher up Mount Chiliad, uh, this is basically the base of the mountain. Like, at this intersection, I, I usually consider this, like, the base. Because once you're up it, you're you're on it. Once you're on this trail, you are going up. So, before we get too far, what I want to do is make this wheelbase a little wider. So, I know this is getting really wacky. You can see that we no longer even have anything attaching our wheels to our golf cart. But they are attached, I assure you. Um, 
front width. Let's make it even wider. Let's take it out. 0.94, this is getting ridiculous. Let's do the same with the back. And like I said, each adjustment that we do, these are not just cosmetic changes, you know? It's not like, okay, so what, the wheels are farther apart now. Uh, all the changes that we do actually do affect the physics of the golf cart, you know? A wider wheelbase is going to provide us with, with uh, more stability, and so it is all, ooh, what's the word? It's, it's a dynamic mod. It is not just a static visual mod. It completely changes up the handling, and potentially for the worse. I am having a lot of trouble controlling this thing. I think we might need to do, do some uh, adjustments here. I think some adjustments might be necessary. We have hardly any control trying to get up this mountain. I think what we're going to try to do is, ooh, at least for the Mount Chiliad section here, maybe lower it down a little bit, and then after Mount Chiliad, jack it up to an all-time high. Oh my goodness. This is horrible. This is horrible. All right, so let's let's try to lower it down a little bit, uh, make it just slightly more manageable, but nothing too insane. Um, I'm just gonna go down to these railroad tracks here. Uh, yo, uh, Wyatt, dude, see you later. You said you're heading out. Uh, also, Pika Pitcha Gaming, thanks for tuning in. Thanks for dropping that like. Ugh! Oh my gosh, can we just? Can we just? There we go. Okay. So I'm going to do a few small adjustments here. We're not going to lower it all the way back down, but this thing definitely needs to be just more more manageable. So let's take the width a little bit back in. I don't think the width needs to be quite that wide. Let's do 0.8 once again. And then for the height, let's do front height 0.9. I don't think it needs to be much. I don't think you'll even really notice a difference, to be honest. We'll notice a difference in the handling, hopefully, but not so much in the uh, the visuals. So let's see how it does here. What we're going to do is just teleport back over to where we started, which is right over here, because I don't feel like driving over there. Player, teleport, marker, let's go. Vehicle, a quick fix for it. Now, let's go ahead and see how much better this handles. Um, Sauce Man, thank you for dropping that like and the subscription, dude. Welcome to the family. I appreciate it. Eagles fan, thank you for the kind words, my dude. Alright, let's see how much easier this is to get up now, guys. I'm gonna attempt... Attempt it again here. We're not moving very quickly, but I already have way more control. I think we must have been just on the very edge of, like, where you start to lose control. Because we didn't change much, but it feels way better. Feels way, way better. Alright, sweet! We've got the lifted golf cart climbing up Mount Chiliad like a beast! Can it get up this? Oh, <gasps> no freaking way. No! Oh! Ooh, don't go down the hill. No! No! Oh, running over a cougar in the meantime. Guys, this is gonna be a legit challenge. I'm gonna go ahead and cheat and put us back on this path here. Or no, we'll, we'll do it right here. Because, I don't know, I think, I don't think you guys want to watch me, like, just over and over have to, like, restart at the base of the mountain, so, what I'll do is, oh, oh, I did not want to face that way, okay, I think I've got to slow down here, and I can't try to do anything fancy, we are in an electric powered golf cart at the end of the day, oh my goodness, oh my gosh, <laughs> I love how you try to set it up, set it up straight, and it just, tips over to the other side. Okay, here we go. Yo, Typical Games, what's up, dude? Glad to uh, see you tuning into the stream here. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Just a quick reminder to those of you tuning in to my channel here for the first time ever, to those of you who've never been here before, subscribe down below if you guys are enjoying this, uh, I don't even know what to call this, this insanity, I don't know. Subscribe down below if you're enjoying my face, if you're enjoying the gameplay. Tell me in the chat if you do happen to subscribe, I'd love to give you a personal welcome to the family. So uh, shout out to all of you new folks clicking on. I appreciate you guys seeing uh, seeing what the stream's all about, you know? Swinging by for a little bit. Uh, Maria Parker, what is up guys? What is up? Welcome to the stream. Uh, Dalton, thanks for subbing. We got Dalton Hersey and Dalton Sanders, one after another. Both of them just subscribing, joining the family. Uh, thank you to both Daltons. That is awesome. I don't think that's ever happened before. Two identical names, obviously a different last name, but two of the same name subscribing back to back. That's pretty sweet. No, I'm gonna cheat here. I'm gonna cheat. I'm cheating. I don't care. Uh, uh, no. 
<laughs> okay, wait. I'm going to cheat my way back up to the trail, because like I said, it is not worth restarting at the bottom. Totally not worth it. Let's keep it going. Aim it, aim it. There we go. Okay, now just a whole bunch of this button. No! Dang it! This is... There's a better way to do what I'm trying to do. There we go. Okay, back on the path. Biggest SB737 fan. Thanks for subbing, my dude. Uh, Javi. Javi Sanchez. Javi. Sorry, not Javi. I know that should be Javi. Uh, how do you get this mod? Here's what you gotta do, my dude. Go to gta5mods.com. Search V Stancer. The letter V in Stancer. All one word. And uh, download it. Super easy. Super easy installation. It's like drag and drop the folder. And uh, this mod's super easy to use. I love it. Uh, Hero the Boxer. Gyro? Hero? I never know if the J's are pronounced with a J or an H. Regardless. Thanks for subbing, dude. Welcome to the family. Garrett, Ethan, thank you guys for subbing. <sighs> Alright, almost getting to the top of Mount Chiliad. I feel like this is, a, like, the first golf cart that has ever made it to the top of Mount Chiliad. At least in my save file. I'm sure somewhere else somebody has done it, but, like, in my personal history of playing Grand Theft Auto, I don't think I've ever gotten a golf cart to the top of Mount Chilia. This is a first for me. Careful, 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 careful! Easy, easy, no! Uh, this isn't looking good. This isn't looking good, boys. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and cheat once again. We don't usually cheat here. We don't usually cheat. But on days like this that we're driving a golf cart up the biggest mountain in the game, I feel like a little bit of cheating isn't so bad. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Oh no. We're gonna explode here if we're not careful. We are gonna explode if we're not careful. Let's try this a second time. See if we can teleport there. Please? Yes! No! No! How many times is this gonna happen? Oh my gosh. Okay. Final attempt here. Final attempt. This just needs to work. I'm gonna go... Where is it not as steep? I don't know. I don't know. Let's see if this works this time. I just gotta be ready to gain control of it. Oh my gosh. See what I'm saying? Like, I'm putting it clearly... Maybe it needs to be more over here. Let's try this. Player, teleport marker... There we go. Okay. It looks like the waypoint was actually not accurate or something. If you notice, I actually had to put the waypoint off the trail to end up on the trail. I don't know. I don't know. Just Grand Theft Auto things, right? Uh, okay. Vehicle fix. Okay. <laughs> the final stride of Mount Chiliad. Jeez. Once we're at the top, I don't know how we're going to get down. We might just drive down like a maniac. I'm not entirely sure yet. Uh, ugh. The worst thing about this, this golf cart... I don't even mean the worst thing. I don't know. It's not that bad. It just slides around a little bit. Like, turning and steering at certain times can get very, very complicated. So we do officially have a wanted star here at the top of Mount Chiliad. I don't think it's going to matter too much. I don't think the police are going to be able to threaten us too much out here. Uh, quick shout out to all the new subs here. Thank you guys all for joining the family. Jake uh, Aspects. We've also got Blake Watson. Thank all of you guys for joining the family. Dropping those subs down below. Once again, subscribe down below if you are new and if you are enjoying the stream. Thank you, thank you. Oh, okay. All right, guys. So the question is, how should we go down the mountain? What do we want to do here? Do we want to just take the trail? Or do we want to go down like a maniac? That is what we need to decide here. Because I think regardless of what we do, it's guaranteed to be pretty insane. Pretty insane. Uh, Charles Dewar, do I remember you? I'm gonna be honest, Charles. I feel like you don't come to too many streams because I don't. But I owe you that honesty. So don't be mad at me. Please don't be mad at me. I, I feel like I owe you that honesty. But if you start coming here to a few more streams, oh, I will absolutely remember you. Uh, Brayden, thanks for subbing, dude. Alright, alright, so here we go, boys. We're at the top of the mountain. I think what we're gonna do is go down like a maniac. Ooh, yeah, because apparently we didn't get a choice there. I did not mean to start it already. Oh, we're gonna explode, aren't we? No, okay. No explosion yet. Can we get around these boulders? Eh. Okay, alright, here we go. Here we go. We might be home free now, boys. Home free. Yes! Front flip! 
Nope, not making that front flip. Pull it back, pull it back. Ugh. We might have made the front flip. I'm not sure. It may have worked. Oh, come on. And we just go straight into a tree. Straight into a tree. <laughs> I love it when it gives you a camera angle that really just showcases the madness taking place. Like, the cinematic camera either works really well or it gives you a horrible angle. But when it works well, it's great. Okay, so there we go. Down to the bottom of the mountain. My goodness. Oh, sorry that uh, I'm missing a few messages in chat here right now. I'm just trying to get us down as smoothly as possible, but it's not very smooth. Not very smooth. Uh, yo, Envy Protegni, or Protege, Protege, there we go. Thank you for the like and the sub, my dude. Thank you for joining the family. Uh, Tucker Collins, thank you as well. Welcome to the family, my dude. Alright guys, so let me know here in the chat, what is it that you would like to see next from the golf cart? It needs to be golf cart oriented, you know, I'm not gonna just like go to the, you know, the, the strip club or something, no, 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 no. <laughs> let me know what you guys want to see from the golf cart here in the chat, and whatever I see the most of, I'm gonna be taking your suggestions, and uh, that's what we are gonna be doing here, so... While we're making this pit stop, let's uh, let's fix her up a little bit. You can see that we've got a lot of dings here on the front. Uh, so let's go F4. Fix it up. Vehicle fix. Uh, Margaret Schaefer, thanks for subbing. Welcome to the family. Fernando Rojas, welcome, dude. Devin, thanks for subbing. Uh, raise a dirt bike. I wish we could, but we cannot. It does not let you raise dirt bikes. I wish it did. I wish it did. I wish it did. Yeah, once again, guys, cannot raise a motorcycle. The mod, unfortunately, does not allow that. I don't know why. Oh, here's a little bit of off-roading. I mean, this isn't anything too insane, but check this out. If this thing weren't lifted, it could never go over this. Picture this. If we were in the regular go golf cart, it would just be Scrape City here. It would just be like... <laughs> like grinding. This lift just gave this golf cart like a new breath of life. Uh, Alright, jump in the military base, air base. Ooh, I'm seeing a lot of the air base, guys. I'm seeing a lot of the air base. Alright, alright. I think, I think you guys have decided. I'm looking, and what I see most is definitely the air base. So, here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. Let's spawn in near the air base here. Uh, player, teleport to the marker, vehicle fix. Alright, we should be ready to go here. Uh, lift it all the way up. Yeah, Ruber, Rubber Reaper, Ruber Reaper. Um, we are due for another lift here. So what we'll do is, uh, in a few moments, when we are at the military base, we're going to lift it up a little higher. But I, I predict that it's going to get extremely unstable when we do, because that's just how this thing tends to go. That's how it tends to work. Ooh, lift a four-wheeler, yes. That is another video that I want to do. We are going to lift a four-wheeler eventually. Um, maybe next week sometime? Maybe the week? Yeah, maybe next week I should try for, because today's already Thursday. Anyways, okay, here's what we're going to do, guys. If you look here, you can see that this water's way too deep for us to get across, right? So why don't we try this? Uh, yo, KT, I read your message. No worries, dude. KT, I'll be. Um, all right, let's lift it up super high so that we can just drive straight across this water lift our engine up out of the water let's see what we can do here front height we're gonna start glitching for sure oh my gosh oh my goodness oh my goodness this is insane guys I don't know about this something feels illegal about this is this is this even allowed can we drive through the swamp like this now Oh, wheeling on accident. Oh! No! I can't believe that. What a letdown. Oh, man. At least, let me get us out of the water here using speed boost. Look how epic this was about to be. Look at the lift we have on this thing. <laughs> Unfortunately, it wasn't enough, and the engine still hydro-locked because it just... it. It wasn't lifted high enough. What can I say? What can I say? Anyways, we are going to be ramping this bad boy into the military base, as you can see right ahead there. And, uh, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Linea, what does Super Chat do? Uh, Super Chat is a way for you guys to donate, but also send a message through that's guaranteed to be seen by me. So if you have anything that you want to say that, you know, I keep missing in the chat, send it through with a Super Chat, and I'm guaranteed to see it. Um, okay. 
Let's get another caddy spawned in here. For those of you just tuning in who are curious how this mod works, uh, you know, it's like, whoa, lifted golf cart? You guys can see the lifting process right now. And then once we uh, get a little lift on it here, we'll continue on to the military base. So let's get to work. Let's drive it into this mud here. And as you can see, the mud kind of has us, well, somewhat consumed, consuming the tires a little bit. So let's go ahead and raise it up out of that mud. Front height. Let's go to around one, let's do like 98. Uh, ooh, not, not width. We do not want width. And 98 in the front. So for some reason, at the beginning, this is what the mod does. The mod does this every time, and I don't really know why, but it will stop. It will stop. Don't worry. <laughs> for some reason, you just have to drive around a little bit. So, ooh, this is like hard to look at. It's almost making me dizzy. Let's get out of this mud. I feel like the mud doesn't help. There we go. And then once it stops, oh my goodness. <laughs> once it stops, I think we should be able to re-enter the mud and the shaking should be done. Yeah, I don't know why the mod works like that. It's, it's definitely a little bit touchy. If any of you guys download this mod yourselves, you definitely need to experiment a little bit. Find what works for you. Do a lawnmower. Evan, I was actually thinking of that yesterday. I was going to do the lawnmower. And then I, uh, why didn't I do it? I think I ran out of time. I just, something came up and uh, just didn't get around to it. But the lawnmower is still on, on the list of things to do. Uh, how do you super chat? Just click that uh, dollar sign icon next to the emoticons here. Uh, once again, to those of you just tuning in here, subscribe to the channel if you are new. If you guys are enjoying the stream, let me know. Let me know. Oh, and also, it's been quite a while since we've done a like spike here. So, uh, real quick, what we're doing is jumping into the military base and then hopefully having a, a heck of a time. Oh, 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 oh. Oh my gosh. All right, before we go into the military base, though, I think it's necessary. Vehicle invincible. Player invincible. Because we're going to die immediately if we don't turn on invincibility. I'm not even going to try to lie to you guys. Um, anyways, what was I saying? We haven't done a like spike in a long time, so why don't we go ahead and get a like spike going, guys. If you've never been here, all you got to do is drop a like down below. Tell me in the chat that you did, and I'm going to be shouting out those of you who drop a like. So... Let's get it going in three, two, one. Like Spike! Thank you, thank you. Yo, Lane Hunter, happy birthday to you, my dude. I hope you have a great birthday, man. Thanks for tuning in on your birthday. Christian, thanks for subbing. Welcome to the family, dude. Golden Gaming. Uh, oh, I thought you said you subbed. Golden, you said sub to you. <laughs> I can't sub to you, man. At least not right now. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, you have to pay for Super Chat. You do, yes. Jacob Ryle, you said you've been sub forever. Dude, thank you for uh, still coming back then after all this time. <laughs> Alright guys, here we go. Here we go. Let's uh, hopefully get into the base here if I don't mess up. There we go. Oh yeah. And we're in. We're in, boys. We're in. Oh, and immediately tipping over. This is not looking good. Not looking good at all. Uh, thank you guys for that like spike. You guys, uh, thank you just so much for your support. Shoutouts going out to Caleb, Bo, Noah, Melissa, Eric, Kane, M Dog, uh, Daniel. Oh, that was a long side wheelie there. What are side what are side wheelies called again? I can't remember. Oh, we're definitely gonna need some weapons here. This is about to be a train wreck. Uh, a few more shoutouts going out to Matt. Thanks for the like. This is gonna be really hard to do like shoutouts and drive through the military base at the same time. Uh, 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 uh. There we go. Okay, a few more shots going out to Garrett, Chevy, Linea, uh, F-U-C-C-K-K. -K. Thanks for dropping the like. Uh, Chevy, Alicia, uh, A-T-N-T. -T. Thanks for dropping that like. Oh. All right, guys. You know what? You know what I'm going to do while we're here in the military base? I'm going to take this thing to the max. Front track width. Let's make these wheels as wide as we possibly can. As wide as we possibly can. What? Oh my! <laughs> that is so wide. That is ridiculous. Okay, look at this wheel width. What? What? Let me make the back one match. I did not realize that they could be that far apart. <laughs> We're living the dream, boys. Living the dream. Wow, this is like so stable now. This is extremely stable. 
Our wheelbase is so wide that I don't think we could roll if we tried. Let me fix this real quick. Vehicle fix. Wow, this is like ridiculous. <laughs> I didn't think it could make it that wide, and I didn't think that it would make it so stable either. The stability is insane. Watch this. You ready? We're just going to cut the wheel. You ready? Cutting the wheel. <gasps> oh, beautiful. That is sick. That is sick. Uh, yo, Hayden, thanks for the like and the sub. Uh, Clay, Nine Eye, Pegja, I probably messed up your name, but thank you for uh, for tuning in. Welcome to the stream. Thanks for dropping that like. Ernesto, thanks for dropping the like as well. Uh, subbed and liked. Yo, Freddy Skits, I appreciate it, my dude. All right, we need some weapons here now. We need to get these people off of us. So let's go uh, weapon. Get all weapons. Let's go, uh, explosive ammo! Why the heck not? No reload on... Alright, alright. So here we go, boys. <laughs> this battle is about to, uh, turn in our favor for sure here. You ready? Yes! The explosive ammo, no reload, is, like, super OP. Super OP, as you can see. And meanwhile, here we are in our ridiculous golf cart with the widest wheelbase ever seen in a golf cart anywhere, ever. Uh, Larry, thanks for dropping the like. James, thanks for the like. Steve, thanks for dropping the like. Monica, Aaron, thank you for subbing. Welcome to the family, Monica. Thank you, thank you for your support. Uh, Matt Malicio Zamora, thank you guys for dropping those likes. All that good stuff. Can you raise the gun running caddy? Yo, Caden, good question, dude. I actually didn't know that there was a gun running caddy. I don't think I ever realized that. These things are just coming and getting exploded one by one. My goodness. All right, let's do uh, let's do one more pass here. Before we leave, are you guys ready to see the mod maxed out? Are you ready to max out the mod? Because that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna have the widest wheelbase possible and also the highest lift possible. So let's go ahead and do that now. It might be a little bit hard with the military on us. I'm not sure. Suspension menu lifting up the front height as high as it can possibly go, which I think should be about 2.0 Let's do a little bit in the back first Uh Oh These wheels might just freak out the whole time. Oh my goodness. Yeah, these wheels might not ever stop glitching. I'm not sure What is happening? What is actually going on? What? No <laughs> Guys, I think we might have taken it too far. I think we may have gone too far. I don't know. We might have broke it. This is not looking good, boys. Oh, wait. It might have, it might have just started working. It might have just started working. Oh. I I need to get these military people off of me. Uh I don't I don't think There we go. There we go. Oh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is like virtually impossible. Between all the explosions, not only the explosions, but like, I can't even drive without doing a wheelie. You ready? Watch this. I'm gonna try to accelerate. You ready? Instant wheelie. Instant wheelie. It is like impossible to drive anywhere. I think we may have gone too far. <laughs> when mods go too far. I need to get out of this military base. I need to get out of here right now. Uh, let's take it... Let's go over here real quick. This is far away from the military base. This should offer us a little bit of uh, peace for a second. And I'm just going to lose the wanted level here. Let's just do wanted down. That that was a little stressful. Definitely a little stre stressful. Uh, Polaris RZR. Ah, I forgot that when I teleport here, it kills the vehicle. I also love that he, like, when he gets in the vehicle, he climbs up into it. I just... I can't believe this mod actually works, is what I'm saying. Usually, with a mod like this, I would expect him to get in and be sitting, like, right here. But no, when he gets in, he's actually sitting in the right spot. Whoever designed this mod did a fantastic job coding it. I don't even know. I don't even know how he did it. Baby Voice 860 thank you for the like and sub, my dude. Thank you, thank you. Raise a T20, we'll definitely be doing that in the future. We're going to be raising a lot more vehicles here going into the, uh, the future streams. Isaiah Michael, thank you for the kind words, my dude. I appreciate it. Thanks for being here. 
Okay. Vehicle spawning. It's nice and peaceful now. Like, I'm glad that the explosions have kind of stopped for a while. You know, it's, uh, it's a little less stressful here. Can you please lift a monster truck in your next stream? Um... How would that work? Because the monster truck's already lifted, unless you mean, like, give it that extra lift. Like, super lift it. <laughs> Check out the difference here, guys. We've got the old one versus the new one. <laughs> oh, it's ridiculous. It is so ridiculous. Can we just, like, drive under it? Kind of. Kind of, kind of. <gasps> Oh, man. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, get this thing lifted up here a little bit. Let's go ahead and jack her up. Uh, now, no spin tires today. I will be doing spin tires either tomorrow or next week. Tomorrow, I might try to do another LSPDFR, because I said Friday would be LSPDFR days. Um... So tomorrow, yeah. Tomorrow I'll probably try to do LSPDFR. I have a lot more uh, new mods installed for it, so LSPDFR should be better than ever already. Okay, okay. Yeah, bring on the glitching. The glitching is part of this for some reason. It's part of it that we need to accept. Okay, did I just hear pickles? Pickles! <gasps> come here, pickles! Pickles, come here, man. Come here, dog. Come here, big cat. Pickles, you know how I said Pickles and Small Cat usually nap all day and then they wake up at 4 or 5 o'clock? It is currently 4.34, and just as planned, just as expected, Pickles emerged from the attic. He emerged from his nap, same time every day. He sleeps the day away, he's such a lazy boy. Pickles is a cat, for those of you wondering. I don't know if I ever actually said that. If you guys are new here, you would have no way of knowing that Pickles is uh, one of my... One of my kitties. Hey, Gitchy, can you use Mercedes C63 AMG as my dream car? Um, I could probably do a mod of that one day, if I get around to it, but I have a long list of mods that I need to cover before I do that one. I like the lifted truck one, To I like all your videos. Awesome, dude. Thank you. Also, turned on notifications. Yo, DJ, thank you, my man. Guys, uh, yeah, quick reminder, when you do subscribe, hit the bell icon, turn on post notifications, and that will notify you as soon as I go live. It'll notify you instantly. When's the next zombie mod for GTA? Um, to be entirely honest with you, I have little to no desire to do another zombie mod. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I guess I, I need to get around to it eventually. It just hasn't even felt like a challenge. Like, I built my base... Zombies don't even spawn around it anymore, so every time I'm in my base, it's like easy mode. Um, but I, we did make some progress in the last episode. I should probably do another one. Um, oh yeah, and once again, guys, I would love to be able to put some bigger tires on this thing. I wish we could put bigger tires on it. However, there's no mod that allows you to do that. You can't change the tire size otherwise. Like, you can't even put off-road tires on this thing so badly I wanted to put on the off-road tires but the game was just like nah fam nah you're using the stock tires and I'm like okay game sorry sorry I asked sorry I wanted to uh, ooh, ooh. you do not want to be going down this road without brakes because then like you just kind of barrel into the highway put your cat in the camera uh, no pickles already walked away he he came down from the attic down to this floor now he's downstairs I do all my streaming on, like, the second floor of the house. I don't know if you guys knew that. Uh, got the bell on, and can I have a shout-out? Yo, Matthew Zhang, or Zhang. Z-H is usually a Z sound, right? Regardless, Matthew, thank you, dude. Shout-out to you. Thank you for the support, my man. Uh, guys, we are going to be wrapping up the stream here in a little bit. We're going to be streaming for ten or so more minutes. Uh, but, you know, you know. Um... Let me see, where... There's this one spot that I wanted to go to and it's slipping my mind as to what it was. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I wanted to see how the golf cart handled a rock climb. This should be interesting. I should have done this earlier in the stream, but it kind of slipped my mind until now. Kind of slipped my mind until now. Vehicle fix. Let's uh, make it orange again because it just looks so much better in orange. All right, all right. So let's see how the golf cart does with a uh, with a rock climb. I don't know. Should be interesting. Should be interesting. 
Uh, yo, Mad Matt Sinclair, liked and subbed. Thank you, dude. Welcome to the family. Welcome, welcome. Guys, quick reminder to those of you just tuning in once again, subscri subscribe to the channel if you are new. If you're enjoying the stream. If you're not enjoying the stream, then get out of here. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. But uh, really, if you are enjoying it, subscribe down below. Let me know in the chat. If you did subscribe, I would love to give you a personal shout out. A personal welcome. Okay. I think this thing's just about ready to hit, to hit the rocks. Looking good, looking good. All right, boys, here we go, here we go. Bro, do you remember me, bro? Yeah, dude, I remember you from when you talked like half an hour ago. <laughs> no, I remember you from days before that too, but yeah, of course I remember you, dude. Uh, Daniel and Shelly Gutierrez, thank you for dropping a like on the stream. Shane ism one G, Shane. I feel bad when I don't remember people because people are like, "Oh, I hope he remembers me." Let me ask. But the fact is, I have four hundred seventy thousand subs, guys. So I can remember thousands of you. I'm convinced. Like a lot of these names, I can recognize. And like, if you're a a, a regular stream viewer, then odds are I remember you. But if you've only been to one or two, it might take me a few more times to really uh, to remember you guys. But I am good with names. I'm very good with names, very good with faces. Except faces don't matter here, because obviously I can't see your faces. But I'm at least good with names, so, you know, come around enough, and I, I should be able to remember you by name. Shouldn't be a problem. Marley Bones, my dude. Thank you for uh, swinging by for your first live stream, dude. Oh! <laughs> That's always so pathetic. You know, like, you're driving this thing at one mile an hour, and it just topples over. Just topples. So, unfortunately, I don't think this thing's very good at rock climbing. As much as, you know, we've we've lifted it and we've done this and that, I'm not sure that rock climbing is the best, uh, the best use of our resources here. You can see that it still struggles big time. I think one of the biggest reasons that it's struggling, though, isn't because of the golf cart itself. It's not because of the lift. It's because these tiny freaking tires... Like, these tires aren't even big enough to drive over the rocks. They just get stuck between all the ruts, I feel. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do, right? Oh, uh, Do I remember CK.Hero? Yeah, that does sound familiar. Uh, can we at least drive up this? Let's try, let's see, let's see. Oh yeah! Uh-oh. No! Dang it! Go, 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 go! <laughs> it can't make it. It's so close, but it couldn't do it. It could not do it. In the next stream, can you try to carry the orange ball in the back of a GMC truck? We could do another orange ball episode. It's been a long time since we've done an orange ball stream. That would be fun. Do multiplayer spin tires. Yeah, for sure, man. We'll, we'll have it coming up. Yo, my boy, Mintberry Crunch. <laughs> welcome to the stream, Kyle. Welcome, welcome. We're just kicking it here in our lifted golf cart riding style. You know how it goes. Riding on the beach side, running people over, all that good stuff. Uh, what are these people doing? What is this dude taking pictures of? The seagulls? Were you just photographing the seagulls, dude? Have you never seen a seagull before? Like, are you, are you new here? Did you just move into town or something, bro? I'm not afraid to run you over multiple times in a row, man. Not afraid. Yeah. Teach them a lesson. Teach them a lesson. Shane, you said you were here yesterday. Well, welcome back, dude. Welcome back, Shane. After today, I promise you, I can remember you. Your name is Shane-ism. Shane-isms. Not hard to remember. Ooh, nice little, nice little jump there. Uh... Involved gamer. He lives with his girlfriend, his sister, and his sister's boyfriend. Yeah, KTLB, you're pretty close. Nowadays, I just live with my sister and her boyfriend. My girlfriend moved back home for a lot of reasons. There, It's not just one reason. Reasons that uh, I'm not going to get into right now, but yeah. She does not still currently live here, but I'll be seeing her later today after the stream here. But, uh... Hi, please respond. Mason, I don't know what you want me to respond to, bro. I'm sorry. All I see is, hi, please respond, but I don't even know what you asked, man. I'm so sorry. Ooh, tipping it over more. Needs bigger tires, Kyle. I agree, dude. It, it totally needs bigger tires. Unfortunately, I don't know how to do that. I don't think there is a way to do that. 
because it just uh, just doesn't let you. Ooh, lift a Merryweather Jeep. That is a good idea. A lifted Merryweather Jeep would be sweet. That would be awesome. Actually, you know what? I want to see something real quick. Can I go ahead and spawn in a Merryweather Jeep real quick? Player wanted down. Let's see. I don't know what the name of the Merryweather Jeep is. I hope it's just Merryweather, but it's probably not. Merryweather. See, yeah, it's it's not. Invalid model. Um, what is the model name for the Merryweather Jeep? It shouldn't be too hard to find, actually. Go to off-road, and it'll be in this short list of off-roads. Um, ooh, the list is definitely getting longer, though. Um, Canis Mesa? Yes. That's it. It has a weird name. It has a weird name. Let's see real quick what this bad boy looks like when we lift it. We'll probably need to devote an entire stream to this because it's going to be so epic. But, uh, front height... Oh my gosh, yes. Ho 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 ho! Oh my gosh, I cannot wait for this live stream. Wait for the bumping to go away. It'll go away, I promise. It always does. It needs a moment to adjust. And there it is. Damn, this thing looks like a beast lifted. Wow. Ooh, and of course it tips really easily, as it always does with the uh, additional lift. Let's give it a slightly wider stance. Let's stance it a little wider. Let's do uh, 1.0, 1 1.1, and for the back width, do the same. All right, so now it should be a little more stable. A little better, not perfect, but actually, yeah, already a lot better. This thing looks pretty sweet with that lift. I like how you can see the shocks, you can see the the color on them too. You can make out the redness still. This thing just looks sick lifted. This thing looks pretty sick lifted. And then real quick, oops! <laughs> That's what happens when you look at the chat. That's what happens when you look at the chat. And then also let me show you guys another option. I know that this is gonna make a lot of people angry, but here's something else we could do. You ready for this? You ready for this? Hold on one second. Rear height. Oh yeah. So make it so the wheel actually holds us up. One, two. And front height. There we go. Now. Now, now, now. Oh, this thing actually looks sweet. Look at that. We just turned this thing into like a go-kart from the front end. It totally looks like a, a doom buggy, actually. That looks pretty aggressive. That actually has a really nice, mean stance to it. And it sticks to the ground really well, too, like this. So now, hold on, hold on. We can make it even more ridiculous here. And that's what we're going to do. You ready for this? We're going to be ending the stream here in a little bit. Uh, before I do end the stream, though, while you guys watch me do this, let's go ahead and get the final like spike of the stream going. Drop those likes down below. Tell me in the chat that you did. I'm going to be shouting out all of you guys who I can in about 30 seconds or so, those of you who drop a like. So, let's get the final like spike going. Three, two, one. Like spike. Yes, David, you got the, the right idea. We're doing a low rider here. So, let's go vehicle options, vehicle mod menu. We're gonna go to wheels here. And we wanna do low rider, yes. Ah ha ha ha! We're gonna stance this thing too. This is gonna be ridiculous. Actually, let's not do low rider. Those look too cheap. Let's do high end. These look better. These look better. All right, so let's do that. Now let's go back to the mod menu. And we're gonna stance this thing as well. We are gonna stance the heck out of this. So uh, can we zoom in a little bit here? Let's zoom in just a little bit. There we go. Let's get some stance action going. Um, so the width needs to be brought in. We'll put it about there. The rear width as well. This might actually make a good video. This is a, a good stream idea. Lowering and stancing the Merryweather Jeep. A lot of people would be really angry about this, but a lot of people I think would also like it. Okay, so now time to stance it. This is where things get super nutty. Check this out. Let's give it that negative camber now. We'll do like point 
one two and for the back rear camber point one two as well oh my goodness so now if you guys look we can make it even lower because uh those wheels are just barely let's give it a little bit more negative camber there we go and now let's lower it even more I think it's other stuff slam it ooh hold on hold on we've got we've got something that just doesn't look quite right here we've got an error going here uh, I think these tires need to be a little bit farther out front width Yeah, unfortunately, it's got to be... I think we overstanced it, because you can see now that that one thing is uh, poking through. Showing through. Alright. I'd say that's pretty good for now. But that gives you... Definitely gives you an idea of what this mod is capable of. And... Hold on. I think we can give it one final lower. We'll do option number one. <laughs> All right, let's take it for a spin. A lowered, stanced, Merryweather Jeep. You're seeing it here first. The handling's definitely a little wacky. It's definitely a little wacky. It's kind of glitching into the sand. I think we might have taken it a little bit, uh, a little bit too low. I think it might be too low. Our one side is completely glitched into the sand. Let me get to the pavement. Pavement actually does not help. Alright, this shouldn't be a hard fix. Front height, we'll just give it a tiny bit of height. There we go. Rear height, give it a little bit, nothing crazy. There we go. Alright, sorry, I totally missed that last like spike. I completely forgot. Um, <laughs> go ahead, send through your like again. Let me know if you dropped a like. But uh, shout outs going out to Dominic Huanye. Thank you guys for dropping those likes. Um, lift a T20, one day we will, my dude. One day we will. Dude, a lowered stance Merriweather Jeep? Ridiculous. Ridiculous. I love it. Try the big ramp at the airport with the lifted golf cart with the boost. Oh my gosh, Garrett. I can only imagine, dude. I can only imagine. Uh, anyways, a few more shoutouts for these likes going out to Gaming TV. Thank you for dropping that support down below, dude. Thank you for dropping that like. Um... What else do we have here? What else do we have here? Sports and Outdoors, Matthew, Dominic, Julie, King Savage, my, 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 my dude, my boy. Thank you for coming back for another stream, King Savage. Glad to have you here, dude. Uh, Vedant, Julian, Spyro, Sports, MMX, Beheimer, Swag, Per Ramirez. Uh, thank you guys all so much for dropping those likes down below. I appreciate the heck out of it. I think I hit most of you guys though. Cameron, Isaiah, Zach, Involved Gamer, Shaneism. 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 Uh, Ant Gaming, Broad, Brody, David, Adrian, Stephanie, Smoker. Lots of likes coming through. Okay. On that note, guys, it is that time of day where I need to end the stream. So, uh, just to get into my closing statements here. Thank you guys all so much for tuning in today. We got a lot of new viewers today. A lot of you guys just clicking on, giving the stream a chance. <laughs> go, go, go! Run, man! You better run for your life! <laughs> this poor guy must be so confused. Anyways, thank you all for tuning in today. I had a great time hanging out with you guys. I hope you enjoyed the stream. I think lifting the golf cart was a fun idea. Uh, the handling of it wasn't the greatest, but it was definitely a fun, unique idea. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. Um, but on that note, thank you guys, like I said, for coming and hanging out with me here today. I will be live tomorrow with another live stream around the same time. Um, but that's about it. Brady, thanks for subbing, dude. Uh, Rocker Alex, thanks for subbing. Connor Connor, thanks for subbing. Is your name really Connor Connor? First name Connor, last name Connor? Uh, what do I game on? I game on PC. Uh, thanks for the like, the gamer, Beheimer, Corporon, um, lift a quad, it's coming, don't worry, we'll be lifting a quad one day here. Uh, on that note, I love you guys, I love your faces, thank you all for tuning in, thanks for hanging out with me today, I love you guys, thank you for making this all possible for me every day, and on that note, stay tuned for more streams in the future, I'll see you guys next time.